Welcome to another episode of Quick Tech Tips and Reviews. My name is Tony, and with this channel, I try to bring you guys a variety of different tech-related content. So, if this is your first time with us, please consider subscribing to the channel and make sure you hit that little bell so that you're alerted to when I release new content. In today's video, I'm going to replace an existing directional over-the-air antenna with a Mohu Sky 60 omnidirectional antenna to try to increase reception in this local broadcast area. Okay guys, so we've been cord cutting for almost three years now, and I have to say going to the over-the-air antenna, a Tableau over-the-air tuner, and a Sling subscription to supplement the uh, broadcast network channels, we are saving about $100 to $105 a month. So that's really cool. One of the reasons why at this point I feel the need to upgrade my over-the-air antenna is because I know there are more than more channels in the area than I'm actually getting. So I'm in my Tableau um, settings page and you can see here the list of channels that I have available in the area. They're currently, the current antenna is picking up 14 channels. Now, being the fact that it's directional, if I move it around, I could get a couple other channels, but I lose signal quality on some of these channels here. So I've opted to go with a multi-directional or an omnidirectional antenna so that it picks up from all areas. And I'm hoping by doing this upgrade that I can get the additional uh, channels. Now I know in this area, there are anywhere from 16 to 21 channels. I'm not sure what I'm gonna get by doing this upgrade, but we're gonna find out. I'm gonna take you along for the journey. What I'm hoping to achieve though, is just to add here, there is a Fox network, which I used to get depending on how I had the directional antenna pointed, but now in the direction that it's pointed in, you can see I'm no longer getting the Fox channel. And there are a couple more PBS channels as well. So if I could pick up the Fox channel and a couple more PBS channels by doing this upgrade, I'll be totally happy. Let's venture over into the attic now. Okay guys, so I'm up in the attic and I'm balancing myself on the rafters and leaning on a 2x4 beam over here with my arm to balance myself. I'm going to flip the camera around so that I can show you the existing antenna and what I'm planning on doing as far as the upgrade is concerned. Okay guys, there's a shot of the existing directional antenna. Now, like I said, I'm getting pretty good reception, 14 channels, but there are a few more channels that I'd like to pick up. Now I have it mounted on a one inch mounting pole and I'm hoping I can use the same mounting pole for the new Mohu Sky 60 multi-directional antenna. One of the drawbacks of this antenna is that it does not have a detachable coax cable. It's hardwired, so I'm going to have to cut it and I'm hoping to use it as a fish to get a new piece of coax down inside the wall and out to plug into my tableau now if you can follow this antenna wire i'll kind of try to show you where it goes it goes across and then on the other side of this air conditioning vent it goes down into the wall it comes out the wall in the closet where the network rack is so now let's see if i can get in a little closer it's this white wire here so i'm going to hopefully cut this white wire up in the attic attach the new coax to it and pull it through and then let me just back down a little bit and go down into the rack and it will attach to the back of the tableau over the air dvr okay guys so it is pretty hot up here in the attic i am all done thank god and i do have the new antenna mounted let me see if i can flip this camera around so there's the old directional antenna on the floor i just have the extra cable laying on top of it for now and if i pan up and then there's the new mohu sky 60 omnidirectional antenna i was able to use the same mount so i'm happy about that and i ran the new cable yes i was able to pull using the old cable down through the wall and I'll show you that in a second so I have this all mounted and the cable is terminated up here so we're ready to go downstairs and go back to the network closet all right everyone so there's the old coax it's a real skinny cable and then there's the new 
coax and see I have it tied together and I was able to easily pull it through with the help of my wife she saved me having to crawl out of where I was in the attic by just coming down here and pulling as I was feeding now it's time to just get it terminated and plug into the back of that Tableau unit and then we'll head up to the computer do a scan of the network channels and see what we have all right guys so the new coax cable has been terminated plugged into the Tableau over the air tuner I did some wire management just to uh, clean things up around the rack and hopefully I terminated the ends on both sides uh, properly so that we'll get a good signal the nice thing about running your own cable was I was able to make a custom length as opposed to the other antenna that I replaced had a hardwired cable and I probably had about 25 feet of leftover cable that was just kind of rolled up in the attic and that's really not good for the signal so when I put this antenna in I was able to make a custom lens so there's no excess so hopefully that'll improve the signal as well now remember when I was on before I showed you that I had 14 channels and here they are so hopefully we'll pick up that Fox channel and a few more so let's go into edit channel lineup and you can see the signal is pretty good on the channels that I was getting. So we're going to tell the Tableau now to rescan using the new Sky Mohu or the Mohu Sky 60 omnidirectional antenna. And the scanning process takes a few minutes. Okay, guys, so there's the result of the scan. Now we found a total of 18 channels, so I picked up four more. I'm going to select them all. Okay, and looks like what we have here is we have everything that we had before, but here is the Fox. There are two Fox channels that I picked up. Actually, three. I picked up the Fox Network, this TV, Grit TV, and Ion. I picked up four more channels um, associated with the local Fox network and then it looks like I picked up one more PBS channel and I believe this HD 06 is also a PBS channel so I picked up a total of well that the math doesn't add up but I think I picked up a total of 18 channels altogether instead of 14 I have all the major channels that I want so I'm good to go so I'm going to go ahead and say add to guide So there you have it guys. If you liked this video, found it helpful, and would like to see more videos like this, please give it a thumbs up. Be sure to check out some of my other videos up above. You can help out the channel by remembering to subscribe, give the video a like if you haven't already, and share the video. And remember to use those Amazon affiliate links down in the video description below. I know they don't change your price, but they do help out the channel. My name is Tony with Quick Tech Solutions. As always, I thank you for watching. See you next time.